How's it going, everyone? Um, so in this video, I'm going to talk about how to get rid of facial hair permanently without laser. So before I get started, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I do appreciate the support. Helps my channel grow. Please follow me on Instagram, DylanBerg999. So when I had facial hair, my first... Um, the first thing that I was thinking of is, oh, I gotta I got get laser. Laser's the only way to get rid of the hair so it doesn't come back. Laser's not the only method, you guys, for getting rid of facial hair permanently. I'm talking about permanently. I'm not just talking about, you know, you shave or you do whatever and it's gone for a day, but then it comes back. I'm talking permanently. What can you do? So in order for me to, to, to tell you what to do, we gotta explain the different methods of removing hair. So there's lots of different methods. Some are really good and some are really, really bad. So the, the top two methods that are the worst methods to do to get rid of facial hair, the worst methods, again, if you wanna get rid of it permanently, is shaving or hair removal creams. These two, terrible, why? To understand this, sorry, those are the two worst ones. I'll tell you the two best ones, plucking or waxing. Now I'm gonna explain why, why those are good, why those are bad, why you should, should do the good ones. So what happens with a hair? If you guys see my hair right here, you can see hair right here, you can see hair here. Now you're probably thinking the hair started to grow on my skin right here, and then it just grows outward. That makes sense, right? Like your skin, the hair grows outward. That's not how hair growth works at all. What happens, pretend this is your skin. So pretend this is your skin. Pretend this is a hair. A lot of people would think that the hair grows from the top of the skin and it just starts growing. No, your hair grows underneath your skin. So if this is your skin, the hair actually starts growing underneath. So what'll happen is it'll grow a little bit first and then about halfway, what'll happen is that hair will start to show. And that's when you can visibly see it. So the hair is like, there's still that much hair underneath your skin. So what people do when they shave is they get rid of the top part, but the bottom part's still there. So what happens is that hair just keeps growing and growing and growing and it'll eventually grow thicker and faster. That's why you don't want to shave. What you do want to do is you want to pluck because what happens is that hair that grows underneath the skin, it grows from what's called a root. So it starts, there is a root under here. It's attached to a root. The root is where it grows. So again, it would start like this, the root, it would start to grow, and then it would just come up, come out of the skin. So what you wanna do is you wanna pluck it or wax it, because what you do is when you pluck or wax it, you pull the hair directly from the root and that actually damages the root and what happens is over time if you keep plucking and plucking and plucking it damages the root so much that it takes longer and longer and longer for it to grow back eventually it doesn't grow back because you have destroyed the root that's exactly what happened with my eyebrows pluck 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 i pluck my eyebrows once every six months now like literally they would grow and they were thick they would grow every single day. Like I would have full eyebrow, like just like this, right in the middle, every single day. Pluck, 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 pluck. Guess what? Then come back now because it destroyed the roots, which is awesome. I love that. I've permanently gotten rid of my facial hair. So that's what that's what I recommend to do. It, it worked for me. It should work for you. End of video. Thank you so much for watching.